Hello, hello everybody. Welcome back to Diary of a So So Mom. If you're new here, my name is Kimberly and welcome. So today I went and saw my main OBGYN. I'm 33 weeks and three days. Um, so baby is definitely in the 12th percentile for growth. She said that in her office, this is the first time that she has personally seen a baby measure with a small head and belly, but be on track with like following a growth, her growth curve, you know, she's following the, the growth curve. Okay. Um, so she's just going to have a petite head and belly and super long and skinny. Um, <clears throat> we're going to continue with the once a week non-stress test, umbilical ultrasounds, growth scans, and all that on Mondays. <sighs> Sorry, I'm breathy. I told her about my migraines and how they're really, really messing with me. This toilet keeps running and it won't stop. So, so yeah. <sighs> Train of thought, there goes pregnancy brain. Blah. What was I saying? Oh yeah. So I was, I was, I told her all about my migraines, and I was like, "Look, it's getting to the point to where I really can't handle them much more. So I'm going to continue taking my Tylenol and um, Excedrin, and she's calling my neurologist because I haven't been to my neurologist in like ten years. So there's a there's going to be a new new updates on that stuff um she checked my cervix today because i guess there's a worry about me going into early labor um so she checked my cervix today my cervix is still thick and closed which means i'm not dilated at the moment so my waters aren't linking nothing like that which she checked as well um my hemorrhoids are still horrible. She said I might have to see a surgeon. She said I can't. I'm not gonna see him see the surgeon before my delivery. She said you do not want to deliver with a raw butt, <laughs> and I believe her. So there's that. Um, I'm also going to. I don't remember. This pregnancy brain again is strong today, guys. Yeah, so, so she said that when I went to Indianapolis and had those, the really um, look into um, the growth scans, she said that up there she was measuring like there goes the toilet again. Blah. So up there she was in the twenty first percent, twenty first or twenty third percentile, and then my next the one that was a week later down here in Bedford. Um, was actually 12th percentile. So maybe her growth is just kind of slowing down. Um, but all in all, she is healthy. So there's there's no worry about her being unhealthy. She just kind of like dumbfounded I, about her head and her belly being so small, I guess. But she said that there's not, not going to be like a huge, huge worry and, unless like she hits like the third percentile and you know th stuff like that so as of right now we're just going to have a petite long skinny baby well petite head and belly so there's the lance um here at the end of this video i do have some pictures from two days appointments to add so there will be that oh my gosh and i've been losing the mucus plug still girls and guys, who's ever watching, still lose a mucus plug, um, having tons of Braxton Hicks these last couple days. Um, so we definitely have to keep an eye on those, make sure that none of it becomes regular because, like I said, she said that we just have to make sure I don't go into early labor because obviously that was an issue where she definitely would not have checked my cervix at 33 weeks or my water. So um, I do go back in two weeks. Which is amazing news that I get to go two weeks because that just that just makes me feel better because if there was like a huge worry she'd be like, Alright, then you need to come back at the end of the week or at the beginning of next week, you know. So I do get to go ahead and go a full two weeks. 
um, until I see her again. So I'll be in there again on the 23rd. Um, other than that, there's really nothing else to update. Um, I gained back my four, my four pounds again. So I'm back at 210. And I'm only five foot. So it's kind of bleh. So definitely after this pregnancy, I'm going to be doing like a lot of weight loss stuff and get back into that. Because I was down to, I think like 176 when I got pregnant. Every time I've gotten pregnant, I have weighed 176, just by the way. So I am like, this is like plus size pregnancy, you know. Um, but yeah, other than that, I really have nothing, <clears throat> nothing else to update on today. Except I have like started nesting like crazy. Like I, I'm sorry. I just ate two Big Macs, two Big Macs. And then a strawberry, a little strawberry pie thing. Oh my gosh. So yeah, my appetite has gone up like crazy. I had two baked potatoes this morning. And I told Derek, you know, it's one for me and one for Ellie. Duh. Oh my gosh. Hey, <coughs> Bless me. Excuse me. Sorry. Thank you. Come again. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. So there's that. Um. Friggin' toilet. Is this normal? I don't remember it doing this like every power four. I was power shaking at all. Yes. So, I've got the kids on the back porch with Derek and we're ready for playtime. So, I'm going to get off here and get back to mommy duties, guys. Um, yeah. Until next time. Bye.